What's up? This is Square2448 with a video and today we're going to be installing some wood sides on this GMC Top Kick flatbed truck which I think would be awesome since if we do wood sides this could act almost as a dump truck and this does have a very long flatbed. Now we might look into removing this gooseneck hitch but we might leave it. So I think to start this off we're going to import the fence and we're going to get started just adding the wood sides and I did take these wood sides off the uh, Dodge, one of the Dodge trucks. So we're going to take this, we're going to lift this up and I do want to do a very good job since I do want to be using this in some cool videos. So I think that I do want this to be a lot taller than what it is and I think even though there's um straps, I think having sides like this will definitely be helpful. So we're going to go here and we're going to fix a six scaling and I think having it that long is good we could probably do two let's see how long we might have to shorten it up but I think having it like that would be perfect yeah so maybe we'll cut this down I would say to 0 0.025 let's see if that helps uh, I think a little bit longer than that so let's give it a try with three I think three will pretty much do it which is going to be awesome where yeah that's going to be fitting perfect but before we can actually continue I do want to fix the scaling that way we don't have to change all the numbers on them all so let's see what this one is this one is the height and like I'm saying I think we want it pretty high so let's go to 3.5 now that is very high very strong so I think we're going to be deleting this one here and we're going to be dragging this one over perfect look at that guys we already have nice wood sides perfect and that's only on one side so we're going to duplicate this and move it over here i did do some videos installing some other cool things like a plow mount installing garage doors cool things like that and a lot of you guys are really liking these modding videos so i thank you for all the support on these and i actually to make this more congruent and uh awesome i think we're just going to bring this over and I do want this to be as nice as possible so we're going to rotate this and then we are definitely let's see which one moves so let's see X so we're going to copy this X and we're going to be putting it over here onto this X that way they are both the same distance which I think is going to be awesome now I don't think we need a back gate and like I'm saying guys this is going to be an awesome way to turn a flatbed into a more versatile a uh, piece of equipment for us vehicle since I would like to use this for tree services without having to install a dump bed on it but I would like to see is it possible for us to hide this now there will definitely be a fifth wheel here but since actually we have sides on it I don't want to be putting a fifth wheel since I don't think there's going to be enough clearance so I think it's best for us just to remove this in all and I think it gives it a much cleaner look and it's not us putting wood on top of a hitch which uh, technically we should be using but with this we could definitely stack even all the way up to the top here in the center and then have it slope down on these sides but before we can finish we do need to import some collisions now without collisions there will not be any um let's just say like anything there to stop the wood from moving but it looks like I do not have the collisions in at the moment so I'm going to grab them really fast I got the collisions in the folder so now we will be importing it and like I'm saying guys if you do not have collisions the objects will just fall through the fencing so this will definitely help out so we do need to rotate this do a lot of scaling to this one other than that we are almost done we have pretty much the entire uh, flatbed good but we're going to be moving this over I think that's going to be perfect right there and now for this I do not want this to be really high since uh, then it won't work but I think actually this needs to be like 1.2 let's try 1.2 it looks like that's actually like 1.24 I think that's going to be perfect right there now the height is way too tall we do want to be able to use a skid steer to load up all the wood so that's even too tall so let's try three and you do want this to be pretty well uh, done on the collision side or else 
everything won't uh, be working correctly. Looks like we got this side done. So now we're going to do it to this side here. So like I was saying guys, we're going to be using this in a tree services video later this week. So stay tuned for that. We do have all the wood sides complete, but I think I actually would like to... Let's see if we could click on this one. I don't really like that gap. So maybe we could do 3.2. Just trying to make it more look nice. Yeah, it covers up that gap in between it. Makes it more uh, connecting on the walls. But I think that's going to be it, guys. So we'll definitely be using this. It does have sides now, which is perfect. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.